What's up everybody? Today we have another video for you comparing the Hypercell Fuse, the Intense, and to the code RED. The uh, Hypercell Fuse RG252 Diff 056, the Intense 249050, and the code RED 250058. So out of the three balls, the Diff is the highest in the code RED. Um, second highest being the Fused, and last being the Intense. Um, tester Jack on Pipple House Shot. <clears throat> just the comparing all three balls the uh, only difference between Jack's three balls the intense is pinned down the other two balls are pinned up and the code red also has more games on it so it's not as fresh cover as what the other balls are so as you kind of saw with the fuse the fuse looked pretty good gave him miss room left and right particularly to the right when he missed right it, it, it got back no matter what uh, the intense a little bit weaker layout for him definitely blends the pattern pretty good doesn't strike every shot uh, he's prone to leaving 10 pins with it but when he misses right with this it, it does store enough energy that it makes it back um, every time same thing with the fuse though even the fuse was a little bit stronger with layout being hybrid started sooner it length looked a little bit more so he can miss right now the code red one thing to note like i said a little earlier has more games on it and you can definitely tell when he misses right doesn't make it back. Uh, this is Jack just kind of laughing because I made a comment. Alicia is also testing in this video and she was striking at will in the sport pattern. I just made a joke that she wouldn't be able to strike on the house shot. <laughs> That's just kind of what he was laughing about there. So as you can see, uh, the ball's still good, controls the pocket a little bit, but when he misses right, it doesn't have a chance. Whereas the other balls, he right, they got back up. Uh, so now we have Alicia testing. All three balls are pin up. Most of them pin up in between the bridge. It's just a blooper shot there. Um, just kind of a funny thing that we were talking about. But anyway, so she can uh, throw it right, like right there. She missed right. She thought it was terrible. So I got back in the truck. Here, kind of in the same place. Gets back and strikes. Fuse definitely has really good motion for her. Soars a lot of energy. Um, you know, back end motion is really good. Uh, the pain just kind of gets cut off, but it's the same spot. Small hole. Um, kind of straight over from the center of her grip, so nothing too drastic to change there as far as reaction. But yeah, this is just her throwing the intense. Um, it's, you know, pretty smooth, controllable, predictable. Blends the pattern really well for her. Um, what was really kind of unique, like all three balls were laid out pretty close. Um, the only difference, her code red. The pin was up a little higher than what the other ones were, like from her fingers, a good like little inch, I would say, further. Uh, but she didn't have to really move with any of the balls. Um, she was in the pocket with all three standing in the same spot. But the major difference um, I saw between the three balls was that the code red, kind of like Jack, didn't give her as much miss room. Um, it was still good enough to get to the pocket, but she just left more like 10 pins eight pins as you can kind of see and that was like the major difference and the other difference that i saw between the fused and the intense the fused was a little earlier a little stronger down lane because it was a little sooner uh, started getting that roll a little quicker and the intense just kind of blended it a little better so just you know kind of for what it's worth there just kind of my two cents on all three balls uh, between the three for both of them i really like the intense and uh, the hyper self fused uh, the code red probably better as the lanes develop a little bit more, but as the pattern was a little fresher, those two balls definitely gave the ideal ball reaction that we kind of talk about. So as always, we appreciate everybody watching the videos. Stay tuned for the Sonic and the Drive. Those will be coming up. And as you can kind of see right here, this is a, a little teaser shot of the Drive. Uh, just so everybody that kind of made it through the video, there it was, the matchmaker ball. Uh, it was just drilled, so I fit Jack up and put uh, just uh, some generic fingers and thumb in, and he threw the ball down the lane, and it, it looks pretty good. So, as always, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Any questions, throw it in the comments. It'll be more than happy to answer. Thanks again.